Hello, I'm Juan Fernandez, and this is The Rundown. Check out this stunning video shot in Reykjavik, Iceland. The northern lights return to the skies there with a bright green light glow that looks like dancing spirits, right? Spectacular images of the natural phenomenon were captured. The northern lights, also known as the Aurora Borealis, appears mostly from November to February. Rapper Megan Thee Stallion is making history as the first black woman to make the cover of Forbes 30 Under 30 issue for the second time. Before that, she, she was Megan Thee Stallion. She was Megan Pete. In 2016, she was studying nursing while creating hip-hop videos on YouTube. She then signed onto a Houston-based label in 2018, and the rest, they say, is history. Chick-fil-A has launched its first ever online store, and it's full of quirky merchandise. You can buy a hoodie, a hat, a clutch, a blanket, and even a pillow. The chicken chain said it expects the products to sell out quickly, and it's already planning more merch for next year. We have some rain on the way to Southern California, peaking Thursday night into Friday and getting some good rain totals, one to two inches for Coastal Valleys, two to four inches for our mountains with about one foot of snow above that 7,000 foot level. We're also expecting those cool temperatures and those gusty winds will still with still an unsettled weather pattern as we head into the weekend. Another shot of rain, especially on Sunday morning. So here's our satellite radar tracker showing us some light rain possible early Thursday, but the main event really arrives by late Thursday. Thursday into early Friday. So we'll, hit, we'll have some pockets of some of that heavy rain pushing through. Even still a little bit wet weather for that Friday morning commute and temperatures over the extended period cool in the 60s for most of us. Even up in the valleys, we're looking at some 60s over the next seven days. Cloud cover below average temperatures also for the Inland Empire. Drier conditions return as we head into the beginning of next week. In the high desert, we have some 50s over the next next seven days, even cooler in the mountains in the 40s with a chance of getting some snow. Remember, we're always streaming on CBS News Los Angeles, and you can watch us anytime on our free CBS LA app and on CBSLA.com. I'm Juan Fernandez.